Now let's look at another example of rationalizing the denominator of thirds. In this example, I have 1 on 5 root 3. We could multiply 1 on 5 root 3 by 5 root 3 on 5 root 3. Multiplying the numerator, 1 times 5 root 3 will give us 5 root 3. And multiplying the denominator, we do 5 times 5, which is 25. Root 3 times root 3, which is 3. And as a result, 25 times 3 will give us 75. Now, we could check if we could simplify our answer. 5 and 75 has a common factor of 5. So by cancelling 5 and 75, we would end up with root 3 on 15. As you can see, the denominator is 15, which is now a rational number, as opposed to 5 root 3, which is an irrational number to start with. As a result, we have achieved our aim of rationalizing the denominator of the third. We could do it in another way. Instead of multiplying by 5 root 3 on 5 root 3, we could simply multiply by root 3 on root 3. This will make the process simpler as we would have root 3 and on 15 which is the same answer as what we have got previously but the number of steps has been reduced